Welcome to our discussion on one of the most pivotal roles in the digital business landscape, the data architect. In essence, a data architect is a visionary who designs, creates, deploys, and manages an organization's data architecture. They ensure that the data within an organization is accurate, secure, and optimally used, thus bridging the gap between technical data processes and business outcomes. The first step to understanding a data architect's role is to delve into the world of data architecture itself. Data architecture forms the blueprint for the management, organization, integration, and consumption of data within an organization. It lays down rules, standards, and models that dictate the flow and use of data. Data modeling is an integral part of this process. A data architect creates structures or schemas that support business processes, providing an understanding of the types and relationships among the data and the rules that govern them. Another major part of a data architect's job is data warehousing. They create large repositories of data, or warehouses, which are then used to glean insightful business information. It's here that the ETL process comes into play. Edel, or extract, transform, load, is a method where data from different sources is extracted, cleaned, and formatted before it's loaded into the data warehouse. Ensuring this process runs smoothly is yet another crucial task in the data architect's job description. The aspect of data governance is an area where the data architect plays a key role. They ensure the availability, relevancy, integrity, and security of the data in the organization. With the emergence of big data, or vast, complex sets of data, the role of a data architect has become even more indispensable. So, what skills do you need to be a data architect? You'll need a solid understanding of data warehousing, data modeling, ETL processes, and data governance. Familiarity with big data tools like Hive and Microsoft SQL Server is a must. Analytical skills, excellent communication abilities, and proficiency in requirements analysis and solution architecture are all essential. Now, do you need to code as a data architect? While they don't need to be coding experts, a fundamental understanding of programming languages like SQL, Python, or Java is indeed necessary. Let's now look at where a data architect stands in terms of seniority. As you might expect, the data architect role is a senior one, involving strategic thinking, effective communication, and comprehensive understanding of the data landscape. Is the data architect in demand, you ask? With the exponential growth of data in today's digital world, the answer is a resounding yes. And finally, the burning question, how much does a data architect earn? Well, the average salary for a data architect in the U.S. is about $140,000, with the top professionals earning over $160,000 per year. ASO, there we have it, a deep dive into the world of a data architect. As we've seen, the data architect is not only the designer and manager of an organization's data infrastructure, but also the critical link between the technical and business worlds. As businesses continue to realize the importance of data in driving decisions, the role of the data architect will undoubtedly continue to grow. Thanks for joining us in this exploration, and until next time, keep learning. If you enjoyed this content and found it informative, please hit the like button and share it with others who might find it helpful. Remember to subscribe to our channel for more videos on data science, business analysis, and other technology topics. If you have any questions or ideas for future videos, please drop them in the comments section below.